Welcome to the Methodology Institute's SPSS video tutorial series, sponsored by the LSE Annual Fund. This tutorial will demonstrate how to recode an interval level or scale variable into a grouped or categorical variable. And we will do this using the age variable, which I've highlighted here in data view, and which measures respondents' age in years. And so the function we need can be found under the transform drop down menu, and then by selecting recode into different variables. And the first thing we need to do is select our input variable from the list here. So that's respondent's age, and we use the arrow to move it across into the box. And so because we're recoding age into a different variable, we need to provide SPSS with a name for that new variable. And we do that by selecting the name box, and I'm just going to call it age underscore grp. And then in the label box, we just need to insert a small description. So I'm going to put age brackets grouped and then we click on the change button and you can see that the information about our output variable now appears in the box in the middle so once that's done we can select our old and new values so you click on this box here and so as you can see we're going to recode respondents age that's currently recorded as an interval or scale variable into six groups so in order to create our first age group 25 or lower we can use the range lowest through value option and select 25 and this will specify all the recorded age values from the lowest up through to 25 and we then select under new value a value of 1 which will give all those respondents a code of 1 in our new variable and then once we've done that we click the add button here now for the second age group I'm going to use the range option we can see here that the age range for our second group is from 26 years old, so I'll enter that here, through to 35. And for this group we will assign the value 2, and once again click Add. And I basically just repeat this process for the remaining age groups, so 36 through to 45, and that will get the code 3, and then click Add. 46 through to 55 we'll give the value 4 and click add and then for 56 through to 65 give the value of 5 and again click add and then for our last age group 66 or older we click the range value through highest and enter 66 and that will take all the values from 66 right up to the highest age in our data set and for that we add the value 6 and click add. Once we've finished all those steps we can just click continue and then select OK to run the recode into different variables function. Then we should be able to confirm that we've recoded our age variables successfully and if we just scroll across from our original variable age, we'll see that SPSS has added the new variable here, age group. So having confirmed that the new variable has been created, there's one more step that we do need to run, and that's just to tell SPSS value labels for our new variable. We do that by going across the variable view, and then in the values labels box for the um, variable age group, here we select on the right hand side, and that will open the value labels function. And all that we're doing here is providing SPSS with the numeric code or value and a corresponding description for each of the groups in our new variable. So our first code was 1, so we enter that in the value box. And 1 represented those age 25 or less. And we then click Add, and that will be added to the list below. Our second age group then had the code of 2, and that represented respondents age 26 to 35. And again we just click Add to add that to the list. And we simply repeat this process until we've provided SPSS with a value and a label for each of the groups in our new variable. And once we've done that, we can click OK. And SPSS will save that information in the values column. And lastly, the numeric codes used for our new variable were whole numbers, so we can change the decimal places setting to zero, and our variable age group is now ready to be used. 
OK, that concludes this tutorial in which we've recoded an interval level scale variable, in this case respondent's age, into a new grouped categorical variable.